Hi, this is Desiree Joplin. I'm in the arm booth at GDC 2012 and I'm talking with Track from Matayo. Hey, Track. Hi, Desiree. How are Hi. You? I'm good. How are you? Doing well. Great. Well, can you tell us about Matayo? Sure. Matayo is an augmented reality software providing company. And we've actually been around for about 10 years doing vision-based augmented reality, uh, serving essentially every area of the AR uh, value chain. So that goes all the way from industrial augmented reality solutions upon which we were founded to today when we're now doing really complex mobile, uh, mobile technology. Cool. Can you tell us about the demo? Sure. The demo that we're showing here at the ARM booth today is what we call the augmented city. And the augmented city is an example uh, of what Matayo has been able to do on mobile, which is 3D object recognition and tracking. So before, uh, when you see augmented reality, you pretty much see the 2D surface image recognition. So we've actually gone a step beyond that, and we've gone beyond images and markers to be able to create 3D point clouds of entire real world environments so that we can appropriately overlay 3D and digital information. And that goes for navigational things like walking and driving. Often, well, GPS is phenomenal, uh, but sometimes when when you can't use GPS anymore, you need a more specific and uh, kind of more interactive way of getting to a place. And we actually have ways of showing users how to get to the, to the exact front door, not just the block or the, the general neighborhood, but walk right into the door of whatever the location is. And on top of that, we can also display local offers and deals right on the front of a building. And it's not just uh, sort of a, a floating uh, point of interest on the horizon or anything, it's actually right there on the surface of the building. Uh, we can also display virtual billboards. You know, advertising is extremely expensive these days, and you can actually utilize and leverage your existing storefront space as kind of a way to virtually display uh, anything, any sort of marketing messages or offers or sales or even a movie trailer that could then guide you to the nearest cinema. It's very cool stuff. Yeah, it sounds very cool. All right, so what we have here is essentially uh, the what we call the augmented city. So the augmented city is we, we've actually taken this entire environment, created a 3D point cloud, and we've overlaid it with all of this wonderful information. Um, as you can see, uh, we have driving directions, all sorts of navigations for people. GPS is, is, is of course, a, a phenomenal aid, but once you get to the point where you don't need GPS anymore, it's important to be able to provide these kind of interfaces to direct a user, especially when they're trying to get around uh, you know, an unfamiliar urban environment, and that includes even walking directions, uh, where we're actually telling people exactly how to get to the front door, you know, not just the area or the block, but right to the front door, get them right into that area uh, that you want them to go to. And we can even sort of advertise local deals uh, and offers directly onto a building. And, and as you can see here in the demo, we're actually recognizing the object, not just the surface of the building. See, there's a, a sale signs on both sides. And then even real estate available in the area. Uh, so just pretty simple. Instead of just knowing where a place is, you now know where it actually is within that building. And of course, virtual billboards where you can play movie trailers. Um, and then also, as you can see, you know, we can just turn, kind of turn the world off, in which case you can still see all the augmentations and just note that, uh, uh, you know, this is essentially real-time 3D object tracking. That's awesome. So can you tell us why you chose to work with ARM on this project? Yeah, well, when it comes down to it, uh, when you're running augmented reality experiences like this, it requires a very powerful processor to render all of those 3D graphics and information in real time. And the ARM Molly platform is one of the best out there in order to accomplish that task. So we're very happy working with ARM and continue our partnership with them. That's great. Well, thanks for taking time to talk with me, Trap. Thank you, Desiree. Appreciate it.